Hello everybody, Destroyer, and welcome back to the Elder Scrolls Daggerfall. Elder Scrolls 2 Daggerfall playthrough, of course. We're on part 6 of our little, little romp through this game. It's time to play something old, but gold. <laughs> or maybe not. I don't know. Ah, Yeah, it's been a little bit since I played. So I'm looking to get back in. Should be fun. A little Pango, 33. Welcome. That's right, we got the bluey, bluey sword. That's a cool particle effect. Ah, yes, we've clad ourselves in gold. I remember. I remember this madness that happened at the end of the last stream. Nice. Okay, so we should be. Pretty good to go, I think, maybe? We're on the quest, of course, to save for a boat. Which is harder than it sounds. Because boats are expensive as shit. We have, uh, currently, like... We have 24,000 gold on us, actually. We should probably deal some, do something about that. Let's head over to the bank quickly. We'll see how much we have in total. We should be getting close to have 100k about now. And we need 200 for the... I think there's two boats. And I want the better boat. So if I'm going to buy a boat, you might as well buy... If you're going to buy a Lamborghini, you might as well buy the nicest Lamborghini, you know? <laughs> Basically. Or, or not. So, that's the plan. I think we'll also continue the main quest of mission or two, maybe, today. I do still want to... Continue raking up in the Knights of the Dragon. But at the same time, we get to make some other progress, I suppose. We have 86,000 in our account. Not bad. We put another 24,000 in there. I think I just put 200, 2 million. Oh no, it actually. Wait, what? Am I doing this wrong? Two, four, zero, zero, zero. It's not working. Some of those may be in letters of credit. If you want to know how much you send gold pieces, you can use the gold button on your inventory. Oh. Okay, thank you. I don't think I have letters of credit, though. Ah. Uh, gold. Well, we, we have... To well, maybe you're right. We have 23,971 gold on us. So we'll just... We'll give him 23,500, 20, I guess. We'll need a little bit of traveling money, huh? Cool. There we go. Just out of curiosity. This is not a ship part. Port town. Right. So we'll have to buy a boat in a different town, of course. I'm still surprised how expensive the houses are. They're insane. Insanely priced. I mean, I'd rather have a boat over a little house, which costs, like, twice as much. I don't know about you. It seems... seems good. Okay, well, we have... What is this? Oh, right. We got the bow of, uh, Ariel's bow. I forgot about that. Nice. We're not a bowman, though, so... Not really nice. And also, it's not worth shit, so... We'll keep it. Let's put, some, put it in our cart. That's what I should do. Or wagon, rather. Let's put this in there, this in there. What does this actually do? Use light. Okay. Nothing important. For some reason, we have a pair of pants. I mean, I, I would drop these on the ground. Had I known how. <laughs> there we go. Pants for everyone. And we have... Is that a thong? <laughs> Jesus Christ. It is a loincloth. Close enough. Alright, we'll put all this weird clothing into our... Into our wagon. I think we found... We found the look that I like. Looks good with the helmet. Boats are better deal in this game. There's also some rumor that you can lose stuff you drop in your house. But not in your boat. Haven't checked. Oh, well, that's good to know, because uh, it's 
whole reason I wanted a house was to store stuff in it, so... Seems not ideal. I did hear there was bugs with boats, but I don't... I don't know if, like, the unofficial patches or whatever fix that or not. <laughs> so, we'll see. <laughs> boats might be a little buggy as well. It's an evil doge. I don't know why they have red eyes. Okay. I think we just need to get to... Should we do... Let's, let's do the main quest. What's this? Gwinner Laugh Woodfield. Find security for your security, your dear friend. It's a quest item, but I have no idea what the fuck it is. I need your assistance once more. Your valor and discretion were invaluable last time you served me. What's the matter of no flog? Please meet with me at Caster Daggerfall when you next pass through. Ubkai. Alright, that's where we gotta go. Daggerfall. Sweet, sweet Daggerfall. Nice. Okay, let's travel. We can travel cautiously. The red one's the right one, right? No, green is the... Like, it's the same thing. Okay. Nice. So yeah, we'll see what she has in store for us. We'll probably just have to keep going until the... The next reprieve we get from... I might cautiously and it's dark. Well, it isn't dark, I guess, because people are outside. What was I saying? Oh, yeah. A lot of the missions are timed. So, I mean, we probably have to keep going until they, they give us one that doesn't. You also received a letter from Princess Morgaya and Prince Luthun. I don't know if you tried any of this quest yet. Probably not, if I'm going to be honest. Let's look. My eyes and ears abroad say that you're interested in the fate of a certain letter. Emperor should be careless. Not be so careless. Nor should be queen. You should come visit me. Castle where you rest. Ah, uh, yes. Okay, so we have that one as well. Uh, green says, visit me. My was just letter. I think we did go to Prince Latoon, but maybe we didn't. I guess we'll do them all, huh? Why not? Just leads to more, more stuff. Just more stuff is good stuff. All right, map. Uh, where's the castle Daggerfall? Probably up here somewhere. There it is, just directly north. Perfect. Uh, I tried upping my bitrate for what I could stream. Obviously, it does not super effective on Daggerfall because it looks like ass no matter what. Apparently I cap out at 4,500 bitrate until I start dropping frames. It's unfortunate, because I think this cap is like 6,000 on Twitch. It's too bad. So I would like I would like it to be a little less blurry, like when moving quickly. That kind of stuff. But I guess it's not too bad. You gotta do what you gotta do with the internet you got. And it's not too bad as well. My internet that is anyway. This is the place, right? Yeah. The place that looks like a dungeon, but it's a castle. <laughs> ah yes, this guy. Eat shit. I don't have a huge link where I'm on vacation, so fine with me. <laughs> Fair enough. Okay. We did a quest for this guy before. Oh shit, he has another one. I didn't expect him to actually give me one. Fuck. Uh, a certain shipment of certain substance brought through a certain time. I trust in making myself clear. Are you able to do certain assignments? Yes? So you are available? Well, that's grand, I must say. Now, then there's a... What's a majig? A medium tooth. It needs to be brought to an alchemist. I know, the name of Ellen Grun. Okay, this probably shouldn't take long. It's a random quest. Well, yeah. Now I gotta do it, though, or else I'm gonna lose rep with the, uh, the nobles. <laughs> Shit. Oh, I shouldn't have taken it. 
We can do that on the way over to whatever Oopkai wants, I guess. Just in case it doesn't copy my quest log for some reason, let me just... Uh... I mean, for the most part, they do copy in your quest log. But sometimes, you never know, yeah? <laughs> and then you'd be like, well, I don't know where to go or what to do. Okay. Indins. Quality. Un... Gewitz in Blackford, five days. Okie doke. Let's put that over there. It's a good idea to save Fork 7 quests. You're not wrong. Thanks to Shadows, I don't even know how to broach this subject. I need to, to promise me on the Ancestor's Honor that you will do what you can to help me and never breathe what I say. Or what you see to anyone elsewhere, will you swear? I guess. Oh god. Well, I will trust you then, Wanks and Shadows. The matter concerns my mother-in-law, the Dowager Queen of Daggerfall, and the widow Lysandus Minasera. As mistress of the household finances, I have noticed that she has been paying for the upkeep of a fortress called Castle Necro Necromong Necromongan. Necromagan? Sure. Complete a large platoon completely large platoon soldiers. A short while ago, she disappeared with a wrapped parcel of papers and came back later with empty hands. She has recently left again with another parcel of letters. My spies have verified she was gone to Castle Necromagan. Necromagan. <laughs> Gotta figure out how I'm gonna say it. If I'm gonna say it. Pick a, pick a name. Necromagan. Let's go with that. You will have a trust to my suspicion of her activities is justifiable, for I am not in a position to offer proof. What I need you to do is go to Castle Necromagan. And find the parcel of letters or any other information about our techniques there. Minister will be returning in 13 days. Oof. That one is a main quest. Probably optional. Well, not anymore, Nate. <laughs> it is. It is not optional. We're doing it. We're doing all these quests. Alright, so we have 13 days. Let me look at my log. So there's that. No. Uh, it's weird. It doesn't. It doesn't organize your quests. This is the quest I just got from here, and then I have to scroll down two pages to find Oop Guy's quest. Why doesn't it have just like organization by by the org? But yeah, never mind. Okay. Well, at least they're on the quest log. That makes things easy for me. Alright, so we have five days for this one. Sounds good. Alright, so what we're going to do is... We're going to go out here. We're going to set a marker, so I don't fucking forget. Or else I'm going to suffer greatly. I thought I crashed or something. Right. Uh, how do I do this again? F. G. Ah. Okay, we have our anchor. Thank God. I already went into Castle Necromagan for a random quest before. Did I really? You have a better memory than I. Okay. Well, that's not not saying much. My memory is pretty bad. <laughs> okay. Uh, right. So we need to go to Blackford. We should. Should leave us with a few days after travel time. We need to go recklessly. Okay, that's two of our 13 days. Yeah, the logs are not in order in general. Only the messages related to the same quest are kept in order. It's annoying. It's not the end of the world, of course, but it, it defies all logic. Oh, joy. Now can we find the place. We need to find Indians Clothing Ungents. I'd assume that's a alchemist store shop. Oops. So, maybe let's go find a townsperson. Bug the shit out of him until they tell me where it is. You there. You look like you know things. About dressing fancily. There it is.
Okay. Hopefully she marked it on my map. Nice. Okay, southwest of here, this way. Wonderful. That was a lot less painful than I was expecting. Oh no, do we have to turn this in first? I guess we probably should. Uh, My sense of direction is terrible. There it is. You were probably the man. Me help you, ha ha ha. We're looking for someone named Elin. Maybe it's not this asshole. No, you don't. You don't strike me as Elin. Elin seems like a woman's name, if I'm honest. But you can name yourself whatever you like, yeah. Whatever. <laughs> it's 2018. All this game came out in 1996. Fuck. Guess we're going up more. Where? How do I? Ah. There you are. Lovely works show is lovely. Now here's a sir sum that needs to be given to Tristar Coppersley over at the Coppersley residence in Warsley. What? Fuck. I wasn't expecting it to be a chain quest. That's annoying. I mean, I don't want to fail the main quest. Maybe I should prioritize that. We've only, we've only used two days of 13. It's probably fine. <laughs> if worse comes to worse and we fail all of it, I can always reload. And just ignore this side quest. But I think we'll be fine. Okay, so we have to go Coppersley Residence in Warham. Let's do that. It'll probably be relatively close, hopefully. Okay, Warham. Pigs are going to war. It's a day travel. That's not too bad. Alright, so let's find us a peon and badger them. Uh, people? Okay, good. East. East for days. Remember when I bought a horse? <laughs> yeah. I mean, the horse is nice, but it's noisy. Which makes me not want to ride the damn thing. The clip clop of the hooves is a bit much. I don't know what they were thinking. Okay. Can we climb ladders? No? <laughs> okay, hang on. What if I do this? Uh, open. Fuck. Legal. You need to click on the ladder in grab mode. Oh, okay, thank you. God, I'm glad someone knows what's going on. Oh my god! It's like a whole new game. By the Cliffs of Solitude! I was wondering when you'd get here. Your ranks of shadows, I'm Tristar Cupsley, and that, I believe, is my sir sum. If you haven't tried it before, you really should. The effect is heavenly anyway. Here's your 513. Thanks a lot. Your lifesaver. Baller. Cool. We did it. Careful. Please don't fall through the world or anything. Okay. Main quest. We got plenty of time. Did we... Did we win? I think it's done, but it's still in my quest log. Do I have to talk to the first guy? It's 
possible. But if we're going back there, we're going back there at the end of the time. Whether it counts as failed or not, fuck it. So, we need to go to Castle Necromungan. Uh, where, where, where is that? Do I just search it? Castle Necro. That should, that should find what we're looking for. Oops. Castle Necro. Aha. That would be the place. I haven't used my marker, right? I hope not. Oh, don't turn around. It's dark as sin out here. Uh, what? I thought it started you off looking the direction you needed to go. Uh oh. Did I turn? I can't see shit. <laughs> okay, let's let's wait till we're fully healed, I guess. Maybe it'll be daytime. Yeah, that's a bit better. I mean, a castle seems like it'd be easy to find. Until you realize you're lost. I guess we gotta travel here again and pay attention this time. We've gone so far, we've changed music. Okay, let's try this again. How does it take travel time one? We're literally already here. Okay, it should be this way. They're not normally... What? Am I missing something? <laughs> you don't normally have to go this far to run into your quest objective. Doesn't look like a castle. Certainly does not. Am I going the wrong direction? I thought it spawned you always facing where you need to go. Oh, fuck off. We're we just in the middle of nowhere? Like, what's happening? So I should have saved before I went traveling to here. Is that it? Well. That was dumb. Okay. At least I found it, I suppose. Okay, so... We've already got our marker in, da in Dagger Falls. So we can get there immediately. No worries. Well, I may have nav navigated this place before, but I... It, of course, resets your map every time you leave, which is just really annoying. It's the same dungeon. You shouldn't reset your map. But I don't I don't know the layout whatsoever. Every, every Daggerfall dungeon feels very similar, so I wouldn't remember even if I had seen it. Okay. What am I even looking for? I actually don't. Ooh, mummy. Mummies carry a lot of money. I should call them mum mun mummies. No, it doesn't work. Get that shit out of here. Oh jeez. It's a good thing we're powerful. Two hundred eight gold pieces. Nice. You get a lot of gold in dungeons. It's underwhelming, especially for a main quest dungeon. Definitely. <laughs> it's like, eh, is that the best we can do? I guess, I guess so. Okay, hopefully my sense of direction is good enough today to where I can actually find where I need to go. Because, oh my god. I'm having flashbacks to finding Uriel's bow, and that was... That was not a fun experience. Part of it was. And then the other part was... AIDS? I think. <laughs> I think that sums it up. 
Where did the door open? Oh, hello. I didn't even see that door. Is that a sneaky door? 160 gold. Nice. Oh, shit! Uh oh, that's not good. Uh. Remember that used to be just instant death for me? Thank god. Although now I have no mana. It takes all of my mana to use that spell. But it is a lifesaver, so... Fair enough. I'm not going to be able to rest. With all these things. Oh my god. We're already on another level. Oh. I think we're still resistant. Why'd it have to be ghosts, though? I hate ghosts. Ooh. Ah, face right away. Even though the combat in Daggerfall is a bit wank, there's something satisfying about it. I don't know. Are you hitting a, hitting a thing in this game feels better than hitting a thing in, say, like, Oblivion. Or something. It's just the way the combat system is. Because you know you have a chance to hit, I suppose. And not a guaranteed. It's something I like and don't like about... ...that system, really. It's like a roll chance. It's like, you might you might hit the guy you're fighting, you might not. It's very much how Morrowind was. Is. I guess it's not was. That's how it is. I see those fucking eyes. This spell lasts quite a while. I think you have two free marks of action in case you run out of magic. I do indeed. Do I have two? I thought I had one. You might be right. I have an unrestrainable mark. Oh, I do have two. Fucking look at that. Well, that's awesome. Oh! Jesus. Came out of nowhere. Is there, is there a secret door here? Nope. So be it. It's RPG mechanics versus action mechanics. I'll admit, I do like the action mechanics better. I think it ages better. Like, when I go try to play... I'm playing Morrowind now, as opposed to playing Morrowind, like... I'm playing more Oblivion, obviously, in my other stream. But it feels better to play Morrowind that way with the Oblivion combat system. But at the same time, I can see. I can see the benefits. I can't remember. How do you how do you do climbing mode? Somebody told me how once. <laughs> do you have to? Did you have to grab the wall? No. Shit. Is there, like, a way to get it to trigger? Do you know, Pango, by any chance? Because <laughs> I certainly don't. Pretty sure you have to be facing, like, full on. You must not slide at all, so the climb mode starts. Oh, thank you. Oh, fuck. I fell. I see, I get it. I think you also have to look like directly forward. Oh. Oh no! Um. Well, that's bad. <laughs> Fuck's sake, Daggerfall. We're in the wall now, which means I have to reload. But before we reload, let's take advantage of this. Try Alt F11. Oh yes, yes, yes. Oh, that's Alt F10. Where is it? Where is it? Doesn't seem to be fixing it. Is 
this back before I fell through the wall? I think it is. Okay. Let's let's save. <laughs> I don't wanna I don't wanna have that happen again. I would just levitate up this, but of course I just use all my magic. Uh, so we actually have to, uh, annoyingly. Come on, bugger fall, leave me. Let me climb this wall. Ah, success. Wonderful. sound. <laughs> Mummy just died. Ooh. It's not good, but I'll take it. We're using two-handers now, anyway. I mean, I still prefer, like, sword and shield, but... I mean, the two-hander just seems better, doesn't it? I mean, it is better. It does more damage. It's all around just a better weapon. And of course, it's enchanted. If I ever find like a Daedric or Ebony or something like single hand, I guess I'll use it. And then I can use a shield again. I'm not sure what that does, but surely beneficial to us. Also, climbing only works on walls that are exactly facing a cardinal direction. So it work in diagonal walls and round corners. Got it. Got it. Alright, where... Where am I? <laughs> also, did my falling through the world just show me a bunch of map I haven't actually been to? I'm pretty sure it did. <laughs> Which is not useful. But oh well. Okay, we went that way. Can I rest? No. Let's find a place to rest. There we go. Damn it. Aw, oh, man. Payday, though. Nice. 368 gold from that one. Oh, shit. I hate when they die on top of each other. Okay, it's the other one, I guess. No? Uh, it only. Oh fuck! I need to equip something. Two hundred sixty-four gold. Excellent. I think I took off like my loincloth or whatever. That will just not do. I can't have people seeing my lizard, my lizard penis. Okay. Let's, let's go back and try to rest again. Save. Thanks, Gil. Long blade is improved. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. I uh, haven't been this way. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Why? Um. Free action. Right. Decayed ghost. Let's see if there's any more ghosts. Wait, let's go in the circle. Huh. I certainly hear them. Is there anything secret from this room? Nope. This room is a dead end. Dead as the enemies we fight. I think we're getting close to the beginning of the dungeon. Which is probably not not ideal, really. Unless I want to drop off some loot. Okay, I did a full circle. Oh boy. <coughs> More Mumi. 500, he had half, over half a thousand gold on him. 
That's crazy. Do you imagine if other Elder Scrolls games you, that you carry this much gold? You'd have everything in no time. I mean, this looks ominous. Suspicious, rather. Ominous and suspicious. You must be wearing some magic item that's activated when held. Works by recasting its effect each time you rest. Travel. Yeah, I am. The thing on the top left, whatever it is, is a. Uh, I don't actually know what it does, <laughs> but it's it's a thing. Whatever that symbol represents. I guess that makes sense. Yeah. Yeah. Lots of mummies in here, which is amazing. As long as we don't crack, contract some sort of disease from them, of course. Pretty great. Oh god. Oh no! I failed to jump. Feels bad. Oh boy. Okay. All kinds of lost. I wonder if there's a skeleton on the other side of this door. Holy tome. Powers unknown. Interesting. Steel bow, steel sword. Don't need either of those thingies. Oh. 40 gold. A book. Nice. Okay. Pretty good. Pretty good. Let's give it a save again. Can we make the jump? Oh, yeah. Now it's all failure for once. On the hoplites! Oh, on the hoplites! Thank you for the follow. Do I appreciate your commitment to these games? Thanks, JC. I. I do have some sort of unholy commitment to these games. <laughs> I know Daggerfall is not the most popular thing. But I'll still play it. Which is good. You gotta play what you like, yeah? Otherwise, I'd just be playing Fortnite. Should be noted that each time the effects of a magical item is triggered, the item wears off slightly and will eventually break. Oh, shit. About the item you're wearing, check your attributes. If it's a buff, one attribute should be highlighted. Uh, check your attributes. This one. As far as I know, no. <laughs> Is that highlighted? F5. Yeah. Long blade, I guess? Running? Hand to hand. Why is hand to hand highlighted? I mean, my attributes aren't highlighted. But some of my skills are for some reason. Why is that? Fuck knows. <laughs> well, if they break, they break. What can you do, huh? Uh, 224 gold. Excellent. I don't remember this castle at all, man. Oh shit, I have to use a mark. God, I'm glad I have those marks. Oh, he actually did a thing. He had a bit of a berry on him. Doesn't look like a buff. Hmm, okay. I don't, yeah, I have no idea what it is. I mean, the, the symbol that whatever passive ability is going. It doesn't, it's not really descriptive. So I have no idea what it does. Okay. Oh. Good, we still have our mark going. I think the gods. 
Alright, we're gonna, we're gonna speed run this dungeon. Whoa. Is there a such thing as speed running a Daggerfall dungeon? I guess it would be. Not for me, of course, but anyone with a sense of direction, probably. This feels like we're going the wrong way. Let's go back. Is that a pass the door? I already went in it. I went in that door literally like two seconds ago and I've already forgot. Oh my, what? Was that secret? Or did I just... Oh, I've been this way. Or I have been this way. I haven't been this way. Fuck it, let's follow it. Daggerfall speed run is slightly under 20 minutes. That's crazy. How would you ever do these dungeons? I guess you'd have to know them by the back of your hand. Because otherwise, how would you ever go through a random... Like, you don't have to go through a random dungeon at all, do you? I guess. Because random dungeons have nothing to do with the main quests. So you just have to... You just have to know your way around the normal dungeons or something. Still seems crazy. Also, how would you... How would you live? <laughs> <laughs> I can't imagine you'd be super high level in 20 minutes. Being able to fend off vampire ancients and stuff. I don't I don't know. From what I've seen the last level, you don't you fall in the void on purpose. Oh shit, I see. Use the void to your advantage. I watched someone play Daggerfall before. Not too far ago. Oh no. The last level of this game is bananas. <laughs> that's, how, that's a lot of arrows. That's how I would describe it. Even if I do my way around it, it still seems bananas. It's like, what the fuck is this? The sad part is I've watched I actually watched two Daggerfall playthroughs. I still don't know much. <laughs> I just I was just casually enjoying them before bed, you know. I didn't really, I wasn't really following what's going on or what to do. So it's still kind of a fresh playthrough for me, even though I've already seen it twice. I know a few things. Like the thing where you talk to the statue and uh, one, one lady's tell to shut up. Like, I knew that because of that. Okay, what's this? There's a hole there. Interesting. We'll promptly ignore that because there's a door. It's not open. I wonder how many uses those marks have. I hope a lot. <laughs> Because <laughs> I don't want them to break. Okay, fuck. Hmm. Unless you chose a class of magic capabilities, last dungeon without levitation stuff is crazy. Yeah, that's part partly the reason I chose something with levitation. Was I knew you kind of it was very useful. I don't particularly care for like destruction magic or anything like that, but I just I do know mysticism kind of spells and stuff are very useful in just general, really, and alteration and stuff. Being able to levitate is always good in Morrowind, in this, in Arena, I guess. If you can, I think you can. Can you levitate in Arena? Can't remember. I guess you probably could, but it's a. It's got all dungeons are like one level. Oh, uh, fuck. I know where I am. Uh, shit. Let me let me get my bearings a bit. I'm kind of just wandering. Have I been at the end of that? Yes, I have. Okay. Having them layered over each other is... It's just so bad. I hate it. Mm, that way 
goes that way. Well, this isn't really helping me. <laughs> but I generally like to play a battle wizard kind of thing. Battle mage. Heavy armor. Spell usage kind of thing. I like that. I like that a lot. Hello, Swift Legit. What is up, my dude? Alright, let's levitate up this, I guess. You're levitating. Incredible. Now I have to figure out where to go before it wears off. That goes down. Do I want to go down there? Maybe? Probably not. I can hear zombies, or mummies, rather. It's very close to me. There's actually a slight sense of elevation in Arena. There's trenches or something. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That was a... I, I watched a playthrough of Arena as well. It's very... I don't like that part of the Arena dungeons where you go into those trench, dark trenches. It's like, what? It seems kind of shit. Nothing much. I see. Well... That's that makes you and me both. <laughs> so I'm wandering around, lost as fuck, which I guess is something in itself, but not something I want. I'm, I'm literally going in circles. Ugh. Okay, let me try and find the beginning. Maybe, maybe this is just all one big roundabout. Or maybe it's not. I don't know. How far back was the beginning? Where am I? Is this... I hit this already. I have no idea what these levers are doing. At all, in the slightest. So that's good. Oh. Uh oh No, 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 please! Have mercy, Daggerfall! Alt, alt 11. Okay. Whew. Save. After we heal. <laughs> I, sh I should have remembered I consistently get stuck in walls while trying to jump on them. Oh, fuck. I could just levitate this. Ugh. I can tell you what this lever did. It's not a huge secret. Go for it. Let, let me let me have it. Let me guess. Open the door. Oh god, I know what this is. All right. Move the wall. Probably is what I would guess. Fuck knows where. Unless you do know where, of course. Because I don't. <laughs> All right. Let's touch the big titty statue. Mother God. It's the army of darkness. Oh, army of darkness is a cool movie. It's one of my faves. It's so good. There we go. Bows any good? Steel. There's a mummy there. I want that mummy's money. Did I already get it? It's gonna make that sound every time I loot this. Fucking serious. <laughs> Move the large wedge where you're standing up the center of the room. Oh. Did I... Did I notice that? Why is he making that sound every time I loot a corpse? I'm pretty pretty sure I didn't loot this mummy. Okay, yeah. Chain boots? Garbage. Well, I don't remember where the lever was, so uh rip. Isn't there like a lever in the inside of here? I wish I remembered anything from the first time I went through here. 
When did this game come out? This game came out in 1996. <laughs> oh boy. I was... Uh, how old was I in 96? Nine? When this game came out? Before I was born, lol. <laughs> yeah. Before most people were born. Not most people, but... A lot of, a lot of people. I'm 19. Ah, shit. I remember being 19. Man. What a time to be alive. And then I, I aged. And here I am. Feels bad. Enjoy, enjoy your youth while you have it, for God's sakes. Because <laughs> it goes by so fast. Did I check that? I feel like I missed a door. Hang on. No, I didn't. It just doesn't. It just doesn't show the room it walks into. God damn it! I still want to be younger. I wouldn't want to be any younger than twenty-one. I think. <laughs> At that point, I could do everything. You could drink. You could smoke. You can. I don't do other things, but you could. You know, that's what's important. I can buy pornography. If I, if anyone ever bought pornography, you know, it's a thing you could do or do pornography. You could be in it. Do a pornography. <laughs> Ugh. Maybe not. Where am I? For God's sakes, I don't know what I'm doing in this dungeon. I'm still levitating. I'm hitting the same hallways over and over again. Which I realize is my problem. Fuck. Alright. Asshole. Well, at least we found enemies. Enemies mean I haven't been here, which is... What I need. What I need in my life. Oh, mummy. Oh, my. I want my mummy. And you shall have it. All this thing sounds so awesome. Not. <laughs> yeah. Pretty much. Okay, now. Yep. This part is new, you failed to jump before. Ah. Hey, look. The fuck? What just happened? Is that. Okay. I just wanted to kill him while I still had the thing going. I didn't realize that moves. What does that do? What is going on? I don't remember doing that the first time I went through here. Maybe I did though. I can't remember much. Okay, I gotta be facing true east. Can't be moving sideways. Come on. I don't have enough to levitate out of here, so it better fucking work. Oh, I had it, and I let go. What's that awful sound? Calls this pit as anti magic, it drains your magicka. Oh, is that what that sound is? What the fuck? Okay, well, that's good to know. Oh, every time it goes into climbing, I let go. Okay. Ugh. Oh, that went in a circle. So really, I got nothing out of that. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, damn it, man. I don't want to spend the whole stream in one dungeon. Nice! Fucking leveled up, man. Uh, I could go for more strength. Strength is always good. 
should be a short key to give you the exact angle to climb. Is there? Or are you saying there should be? Let's put a couple in speed. Uh, endurance. There. Sure. Cool. I mean, if there was ho hockey that did that, that'd be, that'd be great. Alright, well, that, that didn't help. We made the jump and then just ended up in a room with nothing. Joy. The thing you can do is to use another wall to avoid sliding. Oh, good idea. That's probably the whole reason I can't climb most times, because I'm sliding around. Alright. I wonder. I wonder what the fuck I'm doing. <laughs> that looks like a thing. How do I get there? <sighs> fuck no. Fall? You fall down to there. Okay, let's try falling down. Let's zoom in. Uh, there's a blockage to the left. I'm assuming you can't just go over this, right? Did I just get stuck? Oh, God. Oh, sick. Got it. I hate sneaky doors. I like the idea of sneaky doors. But a sneaky door in reality is just a bit of a douchebag door, isn't it? Okay. Why? I don't actually remember why we're here. We're here for a parcel of letters, yes? So we are on a timer. Oh. Hang on, let me use my magic first. Spell effect failed. He actually has stuff. Stuff. It helps that skull liver should have opened a trap door. No guarantee that something useful will blow it though. Quest target location is chosen at random between seven possible locations. Ah, I only remember seeing one trap door, and I don't remember where it is. So, it's slightly useful information, but not quite. <laughs> I don't remember those being close together either, so, I mean... I've been here before. Uh, is there any more secret doors in here that I have to look for? Let's see. Fuck knows where the trap door is. I'm going to play some No Man's Sky with my friends. Got it. So see you guys next stream. Night all. All right. So it's legit. That's actually a game I might go back and try again. Now that it seems it seems like they fixed it. I still own it. I heard this one is the best one. Well, it's got some good qualities. I don't. I would not say Daggerfall is the best of those scrolls. Maybe if you grew up with it. I didn't, of course. Well, I, could, I guess I could have, but I didn't have a PC back when I was young. But yeah, it's it's good. It's buggy. It's difficult. Did you just update. I'll let you know if it's good. All right, do do that. Could be could be fun. No, this guy had potential. Just they didn't deliver. <laughs> Uh, right. Shit. If you like, if you like maze like labyrinthian dungeons, they all look very similar. Daggerfall is the game for you. Oh my god, I'm back at the. I thought that was the entrance. Although I am probably very close to the entrance now that I think about it. Probably, probably not too far off. 
Oh, jump. There it is. Let's drop off some stuff. Make sure we don't go outside. If you go outside, of course, you reset the dungeon. That's the last thing we ever want. Alright, let's put everything in there. We're not dropping it on the ground, so that's good. I am definitely double checking nowadays to make sure I'm not dropping shit on the floor. I tried playing Mortal Kombat once, but really couldn't get into it. I want to give the older Elder Scrolls games a try. I mean, if you can't get into Morrowind, which I'd argue is a very good game, then I highly doubt you'll get into Daggerfall. <laughs> Daggerfall is arguably much a much harder game to play. But hey, you never know. Oh, these statues. Yeah, I forgot to put these in there. Statues weigh a little bit. So we can have to carry them around. Put them there, there. Wonderful. Alright, well, at least we got more options. Oh no. Ah! <laughs> I knew that was coming. Fuck! Come on. Piece of shit. I've heard of Vampire Agents, so don't forget to save. Okay. Well, we have saved. I love it, and then many of the games I enjoyed most were Dungeon Crawlers, Bard's Tale, Eye of the Beholder, even Nethak. I haven't really... I haven't played any of those, or even seen any of those before. I've heard of Eye of the Beholder, but I've never... never seen it. The rest of those I haven't... I haven't really heard of. Dungeon Crawling games are fun, though. The element of dungeon crawling in this is good. You get a lot of loot. There's a lot of gold. There's a lot of random elements to it, which is kind of cool. But at the same time, kind of not. I mean, this dungeon is not a random dungeon. It's a handcrafted dungeon, quest dungeon. It feels the same. <laughs> to me. So, I don't... I don't particularly know... Oh, hello. I don't like that sound much. Get a gold and a ton of alchemy ingredients. It's weird there's like alchemy ingredients in this game. But I don't think there's alchemy. It's just it's just the item you can loot. I could be wrong. Is there alchemy in this game? I highly doubt you can make potions. I don't think that was introduced until Morrowind. But then again I could be wrong. Oh! I knew you were around. There's a potion maker in some guilds. Do you have to use your own potion ingredients? I guess you would. Okay, well there you go then. Never mind. Okay, well I don't... We're in ter new territory now. Which is good. And... Not good. No, it's always good to be in new territory, isn't it? Especially when you don't know where you're going. <laughs> Which seems to be a, a reoccurring theme in this in this game. Alright, so let me just use the map. Let's go left. Let's go right. Let's meet whatever is in here. Oh, of course. It's my least favorite thing to fight. Oops. I hate these ghosts with a passion. Paralysis sucks. I remember paralysis is a dickhead. I just hope we can get this quest done before the timer. That would be that'd be real bad if we didn't. Because then the main quest would be broken and we could never continue. It's not like there's a console command I can answer. To advance the quest. That's what I was going to say. Yes, there is, of course. It's not very flushed out, though. You need to find several ingredients that only pop up randomly. 
you, then you can't sell the potions. Well, that sounds utterly pointless. Why would I ever bother making a potion? I guess if you wanted... Yes, yeah, it's, it's just not very well flushed out. <laughs> just loot it up. I guess the idea was there, the basics of it. Okay, so there's a brick wall. Brick walls are not helpful. Go up here. Oh, it's gonna be satisfying getting to where I need to go. Are you special? Sometimes clicking on things happens. Stuff happens. You never know. What you got? Almost 500 gold pieces. How much gold pieces have we got so far through here? Almost 10,000. Came in here with a few hundred, I think. But not bad. You get a fair amount of dungeon loot and gold and stuff in this game, which is it's, it makes dungeoneering nice. Hey D, what is this BS? This BS is the Elder Scrolls II Daggerfall from 1996. <laughs> That's what it is. Old as shit. But yet, yeah, fun to play. Alright, let's go this way. Oh, God. <laughs> Got him. Okay. Oh. oh. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. That is a vampire agent, I believe. He's probably going to kill me. Very immediately. <laughs> so. I'll give him a go, but uh, he'll probably kill me. Oh, God! Is, is this the dungeon I had trouble with the vampire agent the first time? That seems like it would have been a thing. How do I get past that? Where are the scamps? I don't think this game had scamps. I could be wrong, of course. There very well be many a scamp. I'm just not sure. Fuck. That's really inconvenient. I probably need to go that way. <laughs> it's fucking right there. That thing beat the shit out of me. Uh, why did they spawn that kind of shit? You can't fight that at this level. Why does that exist? Also, why does this say like it's a door? Is it a door? I don't know. Alright, well. I have an idea. It's not going to be easy to do, though, unless I can lure him to a big room. I don't know where our big room is. Let's just try running by him. I'm sure I'll die immediately. Nope, I died. Overkill! Fuck. Damn it. <laughs> Fuck you! Alright. I wanna, I wanna drag him into a room... Try to get by him somehow and lock him in it. Because I do have Fenric's door jam. I'm assuming he can't just open a door. Could be wrong. I haven't used Fenric's door jam as well, so I don't know if it actually works. There's some leveling in Daggerfall, but also some randomness. A great combination! <laughs> Well, I'm, I'm kind of stuck now. Unless I can lure him very far away from here. Wait, where'd he go? No, 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 no. Oh. Fuck it! Run! Suck it, you rat bastard. 
Have I been here? I've been here before. Oh my Oh my god! But I haven't gone this way. Okay. So apparently oh great. Fucking ghosts just die. Ugh. <sighs> well, I got past the vampire agent at least. We could go to the little right and go that way. Or is that a dead end? No. Let me save. Uh, 60. Save over 68 again. Is this right? Yeah. Ooh. Wait, what? For God's sakes, I feel like I've gone nowhere. I keep ending up at the damn beginning again. I guess we're like getting our loot out of here. It's allowing me to just jump, dump shit off. Right. Anyway, at the entrance. Fucking great, 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 great. Let's go this way. We haven't been this way yet. Watch it just be the entrance. Here's the here's the quest thing right there the whole time. Fuck you. Oh, I remember what the thing is. We have permanent swift swim, permanent water walking. That's what that symbol is. I forgot. But we can move fast in water. Oh my god! Drew heaven. Or hell. Easier to kill than the other guys. Okay. Yeah, we have bo boots of water. No water breathing? No, we don't have water breathing. I do have a spell for it, though, so it's... It's all good. I also have the water walking spell, but... Obviously, I'm not going to need to use it. Okay, well, that's a lift. So we'll take that in a moment. Let's get the loots first. Also, see if there's anything else in here. Worth a shit. Any secret door? No. I don't want a climbing mode. Oh, f shit. Okay. The Alt F, Alt F11 is a lifesaver. I got stuck on that chair there. Okay. There's nothing here. Oh, wait. That's not true. Untrue, it is. I highly doubt this leads us to anything. This is the dungeon where I walked through this painfully slow. I remember this vaguely. Since I have been here before, apparently. Long corridor at least nowhere. That would be the one. Oh my sweet baby Jesus! Ice Antrodox. That's the first one I've seen of those. Wow. So it won't be the last, I'm sure. At least nowhere, but it does lead to treasure. Didn't really want that Warhammer. Yeah. This is indeed the corridor, at least nowhere. I should probably cast water breathing before I regret not doing so. Imagine having a spell water breathing and water walking. Crazy. Like IRL. I just go walking on the bottom of the ocean floor. It'd be amazing. Well, I guess you still couldn't do that. <laughs> it's the pressure and everything. The human body isn't exactly made for the ocean floor. Okay. There was treasures in that room. So we go down and jump off while it's mid mid flights. Haha. Wonderful. There's a door here. Closed door no less. Let's save. Let's 
double check this room to make sure there was no secret doors in it. Um, right. Good. Can you even combine the two effects in one spell? Spell can up to three effects. No. Oh. I didn't know that. That could be useful. Although, we have both at this point, so I guess it doesn't matter, but I like the idea. Because, I mean, you're not going to have one without the other. Fuck. <laughs> Seeing the, f the, the door is a bit demotivating. Just like, really? Again? Okay. Well, I don't know where to go now. But we have secured a bunch of loot. So that's good. <sighs> Alright. Looks like it's time for an in-depth map look. Because fuck knows where to go. Oh, piss. No. This is the part of the game I don't like. This specific thing. <laughs> Scouring the map, trying to find the one way you s didn't go. It's awful. There's that trap door you were talking about, but I don't know where it is. It could be anywhere. What's with this random bit of floor? Oh, it's a pit. I see. Also, there's like a door there, but there maybe isn't a door there. I don't know. It's all a bit overwhelming to look at, quite frankly. You just look at it, you're like, uh, sure, makes perfect sense. Thanks, Daggerfall. Thanks, Bethesda. 1996 Bethesda. What the fuck were you thinking? Is that a way we can go? It looks promising, maybe. Honestly, didn't expect to see someone streaming Daggerfall. <laughs> yeah, all right. And here I am, scouring Daggerfall's maps. Oh, that could be a thing. It's a good game. It's old, but it's good, and it has it has many flaws. I will not say it does not. We haven't gone that way either. How do we get up from here? Oh boy! Take a right. We can go up the hole, I guess. Did I take a right? Yeah. Oh, it's tough. It's a tough game. <laughs> Let's just, let's just do this. Catch a ride. I don't need to waste my levitation. Oh, is that okay? <laughs> you never know in this game. I'm tried out. Curtis is playing Morrowind. Lovely. Morrowind is a great game. One of my favorites. My two favorite games are Oblivion and Morrowind. They are lovely games. I used to think Morrowind... I used to like Morrowind better, but I think, I think I actually like Oblivion better. I don't know. I like them both, maybe equally. Both very fun. Oblivion still looks good as well. Like, even without any graphics mods or anything, I still think Oblivion looks pretty solid. Oh no, not like this. This is a way we have not gone. This is what I want. It would help if I had any memory of this place whatsoever. <laughs> it's just like it's like going in blind every time. Like that get back with a bat, because why why not? Is every one of these rooms full of ghosts? Oh my god, good thing we're 
apparently immune to paralysis right now. Uh, where are you? You're hard to see. Gonna take advantage of the fact we're. Oh, there's a lever there. Yes. Promising. I don't care if these guys have anything on their bodies. I say that, I do. There's treasure! Fucking treasure, I love treasure. The door just close? Did I close that by accident? I might have. Okay. So. What does this do? Hmm. <laughs> I don't know. Oh boy. I'm glad people are taking interest in the old games, haven't certain charm to them. They do. I think they are very charming games. Just the graphics of Daggerfall I find charming. Even though they're bad by today's standards. I think they're I think they're great. Okay. I'm pretty sure something opened up. Anyone have any idea what that lever did? Because I don't. <laughs> I don't have the slightest idea. It probably did something somewhere else, I have to guess. Tiger Paul was very ambitious, even though they couldn't do everything they wanted, still did a lot. It does have a lot to it, considering how old it is. Especially the size of the world map, it's crazy large. Okay. I <laughs> can't even make English words for my, how I feel right now. Did I save? Fuck knows. Fuck knows and fuck this knows as well. It just maybe open the other doors so you get attacked. Oh yeah. Oh maybe that's what closed the front door. I don't know. That sounds probably what happened. I'm pretty sure that actually is exactly what happened. Okay. So we have a door to our left, which goes down, down, down into Goblin Town, which is not where we want to go. That is a solid room. It's a solid room. It's a solid room. Man, I was hoping it'd be over here. It's gonna be so hard to find. One pile of loot opens all doors, too. I map this game pretty impressive, even if the most randomly generated. This map is... I guess it is impressive. The world map is, yeah, impressive. But this... This dungeon map is... It's impressive, but also terrifying. <laughs> and hard to navigate. I don't like the dungeon map. A whole lot. They should have did it by like by floors, and you could toggle the floors. That would have been much, much better. I think making it a three D thing. Oh, speaking of three D thing, maybe, maybe this will shed some light on the situation. Doubt it, but hey, it gives me another pros, another. Perspective. There's the door to the exits. Not exactly where we want to go, but somewhere we end up going every time anyway. Uh, down? Like, where do I need to go? What is this? What is that? Is that a door? I, I, I clearly looked at it at some point. I don't know what it is. 
Oh god, I got lost. Where's the map? There it is. It just loads the rest of you like, ah. Oh. I guess they can make it 3D, so they made it 3D. Yeah, I guess that's something. If you can, if you got it, flaunt it kind of thing. Fuck it. I mean, I'll admit, for the time, it's impressive as, as fuck. But, boy. Boy, oh boy. Okay, this is just like doorways, I guess. Here maybe. Um, I'm gonna be honest, guys. I'm not finding any answers here <laughs> at all. I'm just looking at it and being overwhelmed by it, one pixel at a time. I don't know where to go. Fuck! I hate these dungeons. I want to love them, but and every time I get. So lost. I don't have any idea where to go right now. And it makes me angry. <laughs> is this a door or is that a brick wall? Don't know. It might be a door. Might not. That looks like maybe a way we can go. How do I get there? How indeed. So we gotta go down and then go... Oh, it's actually fairly close to us. Surprisingly. Let's just hope we don't run into the vampire agent. Just in case, uh, just in case that does happen. That's the vampire agent sound, isn't it? Is it? It might be. <laughs> oh good, it is the brick wall. Fuck off. I didn't go this way though. Or did I? No. I have a feeling this is where the vampire is. Oh! Jesus. Okay. <laughs> Ghosts. What are they like? No, no, no. Really? It just led to this? Shit. <sighs> okay. I don't know. I don't know anymore. Well, I didn't know to begin with. It's more accurate. There's also enemies nearby, which, I mean, I'm pretty sure the only enemy is still wandering around, probably, is the vampire. So we gotta be a little bit careful. The moment when your rest is interrupted by a rat. You saw a place you haven't been to at the top of a steep slope. Really? Top of a steep slope. Uh, where is that? Like, that's a steep slope, right? Ah, I see. That bit? Okay. How do I get there? Where even am I? Oh, fairly close. Always conveniently close. Oh dear. Okay. Oh, it's below me. Shit. So we gotta go left. Should have brought a GPS, yeah? Okay, we'll give that a go. That seems like it might be. Oh, I haven't been in here yet. It's a cool place to hang out, though. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. 
I deserve it for that pun. Damn it. Alright. Well, now that I know they're in there, is there a door to this? Ah, oh, I was hoping there'd be a door so I could lock him in. Okay. Top of that slope. Run. Oh, shit. They also paralyze you. Okay, up the slope. To the left. Aha! You are correct, sir. I don't think it's the place. Although, it might be. I think we're just looking for a stack of letters. Seem nicely stuck together. Yeah, let's let them live out their lives. Is that it? No. Be too convenient. Oh dear. Could have been. Could have been it. But it wasn't. Shit. I could go down this hole, which leads to fuck knows what. I don't think I've been to whatever leads down to. So away we go! Oh. Oh dear. Okay. <laughs> I'm alive. That was one possible location, but it's empty. Ah, fuck my life. It helped if I knew what the quest locations looked like as well. I, I, like, I don't know. Why would I? I haven't played this game enough to know what, like, the quest locations actually are. Like, they look like. Because I'm, I'm sure they're very similar. Always. Well, with this dungeon, I guess you specifically know it's in one of these places. I don't know what that is. I could look up a map for it. Should I? I don't particularly want to, but I also don't like wandering around lost. <sighs> Let's see. Have I been in that hole? I could do it for science. Just save for science quickly. Everything for science. I mean, there's an enemy. Enemy is something. A skull on a throne. Skulls for the skull gods. Indeed. Okay. This is different. What is this even? Is that a donkey like ripped open all Star Wars style? Was Luke sleeping inside of that? Okay. There we go. Come on, climbing mode. Be gentle. Perfect. We climbed. I say look up the map if you're lost for too long. Yeah, I kind of feel the same. For normal, normal random generally, generally, yeah, words. <laughs> for random dungeons, it doesn't work, of course. But if these are quest dungeons, which have a specific map. So I could indeed look up where to go. Is what is this? Rotate. Oh god. Where'd I go? Honestly, that probably has brick in front of it. But it couldn't tell you. Could be under the trapdoor too. I know, but I don't know where the trapdoor is. I haven't the slightest idea where it was. Do you remember well how how could you tell me? <laughs> I don't remember where the trapdoor was in the slightest bit. It's such a such a clusterfuck. I guess it was on the right side of the map somewhere, yeah? Because that's where I was, the beginning of it. 
So potentially, straight east. Okay. Somewhere around here. I mean, does it, what does it look like on the map? That's that magic pit, right? Maybe? Maybe not. That's one of those rooms. That's that jail cell thing. That is something. Turn north at the tree, jump down the hole, down on the wedge. Uh, north at the tree. The tree. That tree? Right there? If I'm deciphering your instructions, we'll see. <laughs> I'll give it a go. Okay. Oh. This tree may have fucked us. Careful. Okay. So we turn north of the tree. We. Where the fuck's the tree? Oh. Is it down here? We just save. Is it down? Let's just jump down. Fuck it. Oh, no, it wasn't down here. Mistakes were made. Go back around then. This way. Maybe it is down there. The wedge is slightly off now, but that was the right hole. Oh. Okay. Pretty sure I've been here. Oh no. I <laughs> did it. Immediately regret it in midair. Okay. Shit. There's that. And that did something. Should I hit it again? Jump there, just follow the long corridor up. I've already, I've already. Mm. <laughs> Did I? I'm having trouble following directions now. Long corridor up. What? You're in the right track. Okay. So, sorry. It's hard with the delay as well. Because I move and I look away and I look back. Okay. Oh, I want to bash my head against the wall right now. Oh. This goes that way. Do we want to go up? Is up is up the way to go? Oh, this game is fatiguing mentally. <laughs> oh my god. I need a drink. I'll be right back. I went for a drink, it turned out I didn't even finish my first drink. What the fuck? <laughs> Badness. Okay. 
Follow the long corridor. Alright, you got it. Long corridor will be followed. Okay. Do we just keep going? Okay, we should be like at the top now. I can hear an enemy, which means there's somewhere to go somewhere. Usually. It's at the bottom of that large room. Get out from under me, you fucking shit. This is probably where it is, too. Oh my god. Okay, hang on. Um. God for love tape. Okay, we found the trap door. Thank you, thank you so much. Let's pray that it's in here. <gasps> it fucking only is. Oh my god. It's a Christmas miracle! We can leave this hellhole! Yas. Oh, that's what I needed. Whew. Thank you, thank you, Pengo, so much. <laughs> it took me so long to find that. God. Oh god, no. Fuck your vengeance. What a relief. No more main quest for me. <laughs> Fuck. Sounds like a cow. Hopefully we still can complete this one. Oh. Sure. How very sad, to be honest. This is not what I expected the letters to contain. Poor Minister, everyone at court knows that her husband, the late King Lysandus, preferred the face and form of another woman of her. But she still attempted to hide all the evidence of it. Her loyalty to Lysandus is almost as great as her foolishness loyalty to the Emperor. Those poor little children, how dreadful. The butchery of the innocents. We know the barbarism of the orcs, but surely they did not deserve that. Or at least surprising that Minnesota did not want to know. Want it known that her father was responsible. I forgot to read the note. I just realized. Such a grotesque enterprise. Well, I thank you, Wanks and Shadows, for your valor and discretion. Please accept the small token of my esteem. It's not as payment, but as a gift. May oblivion bless thee. She paid us like a mummy. <laughs> Mummies have paid me more money, you bitch. Oh God, that was a th <sighs> that was a thing. Hey, Faram, what's up, man? Come to hear those disembodied voices. Good, perfect. By the way, it's for to read all the letters you can get your hands on after saving. Yeah, I forgot to read the letter. My bad. Normally I do. I just that was kind of like fuck that. Okay. Let me finish that so I can drink this Red Bull. <laughs> Upgrade! <clears throat> Not really. Fucking hell. Hopefully it wakes me up a bit, though. Or it'll have the complete opposite effect. It put me to sleep. Who knows? If he becomes a shredded as fuck, his beard will make a godlike Viking. Maybe. I could be the next Techno Viking. So there's no more quest for her? Good. Okay, good. Ah. Oh, so relieved. Good, good, good. It is still dark time, of course. I'm gonna need to find an inn. Vengeance. Actually, I have no reason to be in Daggerfall. Let's go back to Singcroft. 
Because that's kind of where I pseudo live, I guess. Some random town I picked. Won't be listening as I'm starting a lengthy cast. Good luck having us in the singer. Thanks, man. Good luck on your cast. Hopefully, it's a good one. Alright, let's go to the Fox and Hedgehog. That's. I'd stay at a place called the Fox and Hedgehog. Hell yeah. Oh, not that way. This is actually the Knights of the Dragon. Yeah, might get the Knights of the Dragon quest actually after this. That gives you kind of the idea of the treats dungeons have for you. <laughs> treats? I don't know if that's the word I would use. Actually, this is a tavern right next to this place. Uh, there. We'll stay here. Oh my. <laughs> Excuse me, madam. Where the fuck? Ah. Here's a research. You're the man I'm looking for. We'd like a room for a day. The room is free. The room is free. Could we just have a room forever? She's like, I'll take this room for the rest of my life. How about that? It's free. <laughs> it's like going to a buffet and just staying forever. Free food. I'm staying. Uh... <laughs> Sorry, I don't know what I was doing. It's still rather late, no? For some reason I can't... Oh, no. I can't get used to, like, the... The 24-hour clock thing. It's pretty simple, but I always forget... Like, what 18.30 is. Was it daytime? I don't feel it. It doesn't look like daytime. No. I guess it'd be six hours after 12 p.m.? Is that how that works? Alright, so we need, what, 11... I can't remember when the Knights of the Dragon opens. In kilograms. Yeah, fuck those as well. <laughs> <laughs> I'm American, I don't understand this nonsense. Okay, so it's very much... It's 3.32 a.m. That's what I'm getting out of that. So we'll stay for another eight. We stayed far longer than we needed to. My time for this room has expired. Shit. I guess we could loiter the rest. I can't be bothered to talk to the guy again. It's almost eight a.m. Three at a time. That keeps from getting arrested. Vengeance! Good, good. I'm French, so I don't mind those. That's fair. That would make sense, since you guys probably use those. We don't use any of that. <laughs> so it's like. Yeah. It's like degrees and Celsius and stuff. It's like. I have no idea what Celsius is. Because we don't have any reason to know. Alright, let's talk to this guy. Get a quest. Just got an order from a giant raiding farm and devouring cattle. Will I slay the giants? It's gonna be in a dungeon. Fuck it. The higher up we get this, the more access to quests we get as well, so it is good to get higher up in rank. And of course, if we get to the top, we can get a free house, which will save us a fortune. So that'd be good. A lich. Can I handle a lich, you think? I don't... I don't know the strength of a lich. So I'm not sure. It could completely wipe the floor with me. <laughs> so, it could be... Could be too powerful. 
I don't want to take a quest that I'm going to regret. It's a heavy caster. Hmm. The rest of the world, Celsius. I know, right? It makes you wonder why. Why do we use Fahrenheit when everyone, literally everyone in the rest of the world uses Celsius? <laughs> it's for Americans. Fuck it. Um. Uh, Gil's exploring the Argon prison and be looking for a lost child. What? I was exploring a child. Exploring a child. <laughs> Don't explore childs. That's illegal. Exploring a prison looking for a lost child. Hasn't been sent since he went in, and I fear for the worst. It's a dangerous job, and I'm confident that you're stronger than he was. Should we go look for a lost child in a prison? Fuck it, sure. Place a crawling with orcs, I expect to fight. That sounds like something I can do. Orcs are fucking weak and pathetic. Okay. Uh, what did it say? The Argrin Prison. I'm sure this is gonna be fun. I only just got out of a dungeon. Can't say I particularly want to go back. But, fuck it. Okay. Ugh. Argin? Prison? Probably misspelled it. Agrin. Ah. Oh, it starts also the Agrin. Agrin. Do you wish to travel there? Not really, but I'll do it anyway. It takes three days just to get there. Yeah. Oh shit. I looked around. You're not supposed to do that. Is that it? That's it. Okay, another fucking hole in the ground. I'm so excited. I can hardly contain it. Alright. I've learned my mistakes at least. We will cast recall. And we'll anchor here. And then we can just teleport back to the beginning if we need to. It almost looks like a, you can open that. You can't. Okay, so we got some sort of s sinister prison. Oh, easy. Oh my god. Barbarian actually takes a long more to hit than to kill than mummies and stuff. Actually, I could take all of this. I'm literally right next to the front door. Might as well load up on loots, yeah? Before we go too far. Oh, you touch my tala la. Mm, my ding ding dong. Ah, that one. Thanks for the fall. <laughs> Fuck's sake. It's always it's always off putting when that follow message pops up. It's like what the fuck? Okay, that looks good. Got space. Nice. Look at that lizard jizzing through the dungeon clad in solid gold. And alright. Marvelous looking lizard boy. Alright, uh, let's. There's enemies nearby. Of course there is. Why wouldn't there be? This way. Let's try to do this dungeon in record time. Lol. My weapon isn't fucked. What? <laughs> Am I missing something? Because uh, I feel like I've exhausted all my options. Ah. 
I missed a door. No, I didn't. Oh, shit! What are you? Flesh and truck. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. Interesting. Let's hope we don't run into any meat, meaty, meaty, menacing things again. So that actually was a teleporter. Oh fuck! Did you just walk into them? Is that what I was doing wrong? The fuck? It's like a cage up there. Is there a child in there? Am I still looking for a child? I request that I check up on another night. Ah. I'm just looking for a night corpse or something. I guess. I did use a teleporter. Fuck knows where I am now, though. So this is a random dungeon. This could be a fucking disaster. Okay, there's more... More of these. Not too bad. Oh my god, there's a lot of them. Look like naked dudes. <laughs> oh my god! They're like Ken dolls. <laughs> Second thought, why would I pick up a shirt? Okay. Oh, hey. More golds. Fuck yeah. As soon as we find what we're looking for, we're out of here. Like, there is no reason to be in any dungeon longer than you have to, I feel like. It's always tempting to keep like, well, I can keep exploring, there's more loot to be found. There's a lot of, there's a lot of walls and a lot of loots. Not all brick walls work the same. You have to walk into some, touch others, and then they teleport you, do nothing, sometimes they kill you instantly. No. Oh. Fuck. Hello, Xenocide? What's up? Oh my. I don't. I'm already lost. I lost my. I lost my everything. Oh, okay. Calm down. Bash that hit him. I'm hoping we'll find some more nice gear. That would be good. I don't know if we have to... I'm assuming we have to be a certain level before, like, certain gear will start spawning, of course. Oh, it's one of these, like, really steep hills. I find those so strange. Yeah, they never have any loot. Let's just make sure we explore this properly. The thief just died. And I had nothing to do with it. Just she just died. Natural causes. We have a sword to your gullet is a natural cause. Which it isn't, of course. Hmm. There's some leveling for the loot. Yeah, that's what I figure. It makes sense. That's how all most games work. Then again, I found some stuff pretty early on. So, <laughs> yes. Steal a pauldron. It looks, it looks swanky. I'll take it. My stuff's better, of course, but uh, there's water there. Everybody loves loves the dagger full of water. So it looks like a pool of ink. What are these? Who who thought this was a good idea for a piece? You know, it'd be good if we had a really steep incline that you could just walk up, but it looks like you can't. That sounds great. Put it in the set. Who knows? 
Quite frankly, who cares? What are the what even is that? Armbands, get that shit out of here. We'll not explore that yet. I guess. Guess I'll go back to the water. Explaining that is a bit long. Don't worry, I got all day. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's fine. I, I get it. There's probably some specific reason. That's all I need. God, it's the noisy slaughterfish. I'd love to know how they make so much noise underwater, but who knows. Careful not to get climbing mode into a chair. So this is the bottom of that water that shaft. Guess we'll take the elevator up then. Dungeons are made of handmade modules stuck randomly to create different dungeons. I know that, but like why that bit? <laughs> they could have made it without that bit, surely. Just make it go longer. Why does it have to be... St they have one and they have the steep one. Like, I feel like they could have just done it with the normal one. The normal incline that's not steep, you know? Maybe not. I don't know. Fuck you, Speedray. Two kind of modules. Inner modules with four sides, each side with two entries. Then the border modules that are loop backs because you can't go any further. Oh, I'm already I'm already confused. <laughs> Just kidding. Ugh. Okay, where the oh, fuck? This one doesn't seem so crazy though, at least. Compared to the other one. This is actually much more tame, looking at the layout of it. The slopes are just loop backs between the two entries of the same side of the neighboring inner module. I'll take your word for it. Oh, there's a door there. How did I miss that? Alright, forward we go. Onward to slaughter. Oh, wait, what? It was underground. Oh, I missed a door under water. Fuck. Didn't realize. Oh, yeah. Probably leads to nothing, ultimately, but hey. We'll have a look. In any case, you find them at the borders of the dungeon. Oh, okay. So basically they can't go any... F you won't find any more wall any further than that. Is that what you tell me? Maybe? Maybe not? <laughs> this dungeon actually isn't that big. I go about that little... little thing with Bob. I'm still not sure exactly how it reads. I get it, but I don't. Gotcha. I get it. Oh, it is a dead end. Good. It's a good loose layer, of course. A finally drawn villain reveals the secret location of the community of Vanusa. Wonderful. I'm sure we'll visit there someday. Okay, because I can't be bothered to walk out of here, we're just gonna recall. That's why it's good to put it at the dungeon entrance, then you can just... Boom! There you are. Enemy? You're an orc. The 
orc warlord. Take it all. Go throw it in the throw it in the wagon. This is before we took all those teleporters. That's so probably good, actually. Uh, there it is. Okay. Put there. Oh. Good thing you can't put your horse in your wagon. Wouldn't that be unusual? Horses in the wagon is where you need them. Back and played for an hour. Has it been an hour since you got back on? Because <laughs> I don't feel like it has. I think you've been gone for like 20 minutes, looks legit. Although, maybe longer. I, I don't know anymore. <laughs> Time flies and you're having fun, right? <sighs> God. So quests and random maps are the two ways to learn dungeon locations. But can't you just look up dungeons anyway? Like, why would I ever go to a random dungeon without any quest? It seems like madness, really. Because I know I wouldn't, quite frankly. Oh, we never went this way. It's not like any, it's not like a random dungeon has anything that you wouldn't find in any other random dungeon that you're going to get for a quest. It seems crazy. No Man's Sky is difficult at first, but it's relaxing and fun. Nice. I'll probably give it another try, maybe. Could be, could be fun. Probably not make videos of it or anything, but I streamed it once, like, when it came out, and I was just like... Yeah. <laughs> but if they did some stuff to it, might be worth trying again. Who knows? Alright, take that. That. Okay, there's a lot of brick wall teleporters in this world, in this map. Well, I won't have any quest targets, so loot and fun. Oof. I don't I don't know what the fuck is this fun you speak of. Oh, Jesus. I'm just kidding. I I do I do actually enjoy the dungeon dungeoning. It's just when I get lost, I, I start I start struggling. Once I've exhausted all options, and I'm like, okay, what do I do now? Well, I've exhausted all options I could find, I should say. Obviously, if I, if I exhausted all options, I would be done with the dungeon. Okay, this is just Teleport City. Okay. I, I, how am I supposed to have a sense of direction in this dungeon? <laughs> <laughs> it's just teleporting me everywhere. I'm just gonna look at my map and be like, how do I get back to there? Fuck knows. Not really sure what I'm looking for exactly. I'm sure it'll update once I find it. And I'm sure I'll know once I find it. Assuming I'm looking for a dead knight. But will he be a body on the ground? Will he be a... A letter? Saying he died? I don't know. I've done a quest like this before. I should know. Oops. <laughs> I broke the bat. Breaking bat. My favorite TV show. I haven't I haven't fully explored this chunk yet. So let's do that first. I want another big gear upgrade. I want to find another piece of cool gear. I need some better leggings and boots. That would be good. Do 
hardware and steel. I'm not some steel pel steel pleb. Okay. I hear a lion, aka a slaughterfish. I don't know why they sound the way they do. They are. Hmm. What's what's up with this? Why is there a brick wall behind a barricade bookcase? Oh, I didn't actually know that was going to do anything. Oh, fuck. Where am I now? Oh. <laughs> okay. Here. I'm sure we're on the right path, right? Let's fucking keep at it. Out of the corner of my just not so much shit gear for everyone. We'll probably be looking for an orc, I'd imagine. I think we're looking for an orc with a note on him. Do you ever plan on doing much third age playthroughs? Not really. I kind of lost interest in the Third Age Total War mod. Unless you mean Third Age, like Lord of the Rings of Third Age. Which is entirely different. <laughs> but that's, that game doesn't feel like you'd play through it more than once. What the fuck is this? To me? Hmm. Uh, levitate. <laughs> How, how strange. Oh my god. It only worked. Weird. Okay. Don't know if that helped me any. But it felt like a little secret teleporter boy. Why would there be a little boy in this prison? I ask. It seems not like a place for children. Why would we send a knight to find a child here? Who knows? Maybe he got abducted. There are a lot of... A lot of flesh antronachs here. I don't like... <laughs> yeah. The prospect is disgusting! Teleporter. Excellent. I think. Oh, eat shit and die. Are you serious? Fuck's sake. <laughs> Never mind. Not not great. Shoot me back to the beginning. Alright. Fuck. There's so many ways to go. So many random teleporters. This is hell. This is arguably harder to navigate because of all the teleporters. Although each chunk is very self-contained, I guess. So it's at least not a fucking shit fest to look at. Where have I been? We'll have to go through the chain of teleporters again. But we'll need to make sure we know where to stop. there? How do we get there? So once we're on the right, far right side, perhaps, that's where we need to, to give it a stop. Alright, now my friends want to play Rocket League, see ya. Alright, see ya, man. Have fun pushing a ball with a car. <laughs> uh, okay, enemy. Another Orc Warlord. Sure. The only time I see orcs is when I rest, which is strange. Considering this place is supposed to be crawling with orcs, he says. 
crawling my ass. Okay. So... Here... I should probably double check where I am. This, is, this looks promising. Actually, no, it doesn't. Although we haven't been there. So we gotta go around this little weird spiral staircase thing. And then... Is this way? No. No. I keep seeing that loot pile and I'm thinking, oh, loot. But it's just a shirt. I know it. Because I left it there. Okay. We didn't go this way. Oh, straight. It's like fate becoming one with the wall. I'll take that. He won't need it anymore. Although, of course, I don't need it either. Since I don't use mithril. Not what I mean. Since I don't use maces. Although I don't use mithril either. I have adamantium, which is better than mithril. I know. Crazy. Oh my god. There's like a billion of them. Right, let's kill you over here. Dig through your corpses. We'll take the light dagger things, I guess. Might as well. Please no. <laughs> None of that. I don't know why it does that. It's just like the sound bugs out. It's fucking crazy. I hate it. Just for curiosity's sake, I'm gonna try out a bow. Oh, is this it? Recipe oh. a potion recipe. I thought it was I thought it would be the one. Oh, I think all the doors is open. There's a lot of barbarians in here. Ooh. Alright, let's just get rid of this so Pile goes away. Oh, hello. Missile sword, excellent. Let's put this on the corpse. A gray shirt, wow. Truly. Didn't really want to wear the gray shirt, of course. I didn't really even want to pick it up. Sometimes sounds glitch outs, especially looping ones, I guess. At least it usually happens with fires, torches sounds. Ah. It's unusual. Oh. What do we have here? What am I wearing anyway? Elven boots of water walking. Steel boots with a magic enchantment on. We'll have a look. I'm not gonna put them on though. But I am very curious as to what is on them. Ah, oh, nice. We're finding... Ah, uh, piss. Pardon stuff. Stuff is good. Okay, I think we've looted all these bodies. Yeah, the exit closed once I opened that door. I see. So there's no loot in any of these. I guess all the loot was in the middle of the room. Oh, there is a loot in this one. I stand corrected. I was going to say something about bow and arrows. I was just curious as to how they work. So I'm going to equip one quickly. Now that I have some arrows. Let's just try shooting one. And I'd guess, of course, you might not hit, so. <laughs> Is being an archer good in this game? I'm not going to be one, obviously, but... It's a cool idea. Uh... Oh. I'm trying to unequip the 
Oh, where's my sword? Oh, it's a magic item. Fuck. Scare me there. I was very worried. Wait. Where's my where's my fabulous yellow key? There it is. Okay. Crisis averted. Useful I don't know what the archery skill of your character. Oh my archery skill is terrible. I don't plan on using a bow at all. I'm just saying, like, if you wanted to make a character around archery, would it be any good? Or is it just one of those useless skills? Like, I don't feel like wizards are particularly good in this. I feel like it'd be very difficult to be a full-on wizard. Another orc. Every time we rest, orc warlord. They do carry a fair amount of gold, though, and a lot of gear. Why do they have, like, enough to equip five people? It's a bit much, eh? Huh? I've seen archery runs. Oh. Could be fun, I suppose. Seems cool. Okay. Let me have a look at the map now. <sighs> so we clearly gone that way. I didn't explore all those cells, which means it's not gonna. When I look at the maps, I'm gonna be like, oh. Let me just walk into all these real quick. I want to have everything explored. Where'd you come from? This room was empty a second ago. Doesn't do anything, but I forget to hit it anyway. Yeah. Why not? Okay, so yeah, that's pretty much that dealt with there. Uh, so that goes up. This is a wall. This goes down. I think in this chunk we've cleared it. I don't know where where else we would go there. And hand to hand ones too, monk style. I actually I watched the hand to hand one as well. It actually seems pretty good, surprisingly. <laughs> it seems it seems effective. You attack very quickly they all hand to hand okay so I don't know where the t teleporter is just gotta run around until I find it I suppose I don't think we need to go underwater do we? did we go underwater? <laughs> well I mean we went underwater but did we go underwater for a teleporter? I don't think so but I have been known to be wrong. Um, yeah. Speed affects your attacks in hand or otherwise. Uh, might be putting some points, some more points on the speed. Okay, so we can go down. For some reason, I'm not finding any of the teleporters now. I couldn't get enough of them earlier. Now look at us. Couldn't buy myself a teleporter. Ah. Although I don't know if this was useful. Just kind of wandering at this point, hoping I find something. There's a thing, but we can go to here. Nothing. Let me just double check this room. Make sure there's no secret doors. Nope. Yeah, that one you actually have to press activate. But the other ones you just walk through. There's a trap door here, I just noticed. Maybe that's where we need to go. 
How does one open this trap door, I wonder? It's probably something within this module, right? Or is it? Uh, can, uh, can, a th can a lever you activate in the beginning of this dungeon affect something far away in the dungeon? I don't think so, right? <laughs> it's entirely speculation. I have no idea. Okay, I remember coming out of here. That's the teleporter. Let's go back. I feel like maybe we might have missed something. Perhaps. I think after we get out of here, we'll go, uh... We'll try another quest for one of the people in my, uh... My log. That I have a note from. Just gonna be thorough. Right, I went in that one. That took me to. Let's just see. Oh, yeah, it took us in a circle. It takes you back up to here. So I guess we'll just go through this one. And that takes me to here, which leaves me in the middle, I guess. That looks like a room that either we didn't see the back of, or it keeps going. Ah. And yes, it should be in the same module. I think it's only possible exception. It could be the main quest dungeons. Seems reasonable. <laughs> Alright. Well, then we need to get back to that trap door somehow. Although I don't know where the lever to open it is. It might be some random item. Like a skull or a torche. Is there another way to go? Oh yeah, there was that. I took that last time. <clears throat> what if we go back through this? Oh, it's different. <clears throat> Excuse me. Hey, look. It's a lever. Ah, maybe the trapdoor's open now. And now we're back at the beginning. I think we I think we found what we were looking for. Let's throw all that in there. That's definitely weighs a ton. I'm happy with the amount of loot we're getting out of here. We have to go sell soon. We're at 416 of 750. Which is quite a bit of weight. Alright, so now I just have to follow the teleporters until I get to that trap door. Sounds easy enough in theory, but then I realize I don't actually know realistically how I get out there. <laughs> I don't know which module it was in. It was this one? No. Uh, I feel like we'll see it. We'll definitely know when we find it. This was the route I took, no? I think we're on the right path. Okay, it's not there. Oh, shit! That's the one, because you appear above the trap door. Okay, perfect. Really? That's it? That can't be all. Well, that sucks my ass. <laughs> Come on, climbing mode.
Well, that's problematic. No? I was expecting that to be the place. <clears throat> Not just a dead end room. Okay. That leaves me with uh that's one close location, seems it's not the one though. Damn. Couldn't be easy, could it? I don't even know what the quest locations are. How do you know these things? What have I missed? I don't see anything I've missed particularly. Maybe that? Yeah, that's close to where I am. Fucking difficult. Oh, I found it! Uh, that is underwhelming as I was expecting. Okay. Well, pish. Lots of nope going on. Okay. These are all solid wall. What about this? That's potentially not where we go. Oh. Okay. They just hadn't loaded. Never mind. These dungeons are an exercise in patience, aren't they? I'm not a patient man. But when I do patience, I go big. I don't know. I don't know where to go. At all. I guess we wander around for an hour. Running out of ideas, there's something that can be done to check if we miss something or not. Alright. I'm all ears. Pongo. Pengo. Because I am out of ideas. It'd probably be like, you need to click on this random skull to open the wall somewhere. So Ugh, I don't like that. <coughs> There's a way to cycle through quest locations, but you must first enable cheats in game setup. Ah. Yeah, I'm not going to do that, though. I've heard that's an option, but I don't particularly want to do that. Because that literally is just blatantly cheating, isn't it? I'm not trying to cheat my way through the game. I'm just trying to avoid bugs, really. Okay, let's, let's go in this thing here. You actually can't get up there unless you can fly. But what, didn't it take us to the beginning? I mean, I might have... I'm not that blind. I was going to say, I might have missed, just looked at it and didn't loot it. Depends how you use it. The idea here is to check if there's more to the dungeon than what you already found. Well, I'm sure there is. 
<laughs> that's how. That's usually. That's usually the thing. I look over everything, and then at the very end of my sanity, I'll be like, "Oh, there's this one way I didn't somehow find," and it'll be in there. I'm just like, "Ah, that's makes you want to rip your hair out." Like, Uriel's bow is a prime example when I was looking for that. Oh my god. I spent so long just looking for this one single way I didn't go. And it was so infuriating. And then I got Uriel's bow. Whoops. <laughs> whoop de doo Okay. I thought it would be worth more. That's usually true, but sometimes you face a buggy dungeon and you couldn't reach your target no matter what, for example. Oh. I heard an orc. Very briefly. I wonder... I'm looking for an orc. I'm pretty sure. Sounds like he's this way? Where are you, Orc? He sounds like he's this way. Hmm. Where's that Orc? I need... It. I'm, conf I'm confident that's what I'm looking for. You didn't specifically tell me I was looking for an orc, but that's what happened last time I had to look for a knight. I was looking for an orc warlord or something. And he had a letter on him about it. I can hear him, but can't see him. Ah. That's the first-hand experience of dungeons that weren't fully connected to the entrance. No. <laughs> well, maybe I'll look into it. I don't know how to enable cheats, though. Oh, wait, that... Look at that! There's a hallway there, but it was above that, so it looked like it was part of that one. How does one get there? I don't know how you actually get there. I guess you have to teleport there. There's still... There's still hope. I think I found it. I just don't... Don't know how to get there. <laughs> so we're gonna try through the wonderful magic of teleportation. Let's go find all these. There we go. Okay, we're back at the entrance. Let's, uh... Did we get anything since then? Apparently I got a, a gray skirt and a book. Wonderful. It's probably an orc. Hey, look! I should be happy, but this pisses me off. <laughs> he just randomly appears when you rest? Fuck you. As the orc dies, it begins to speak strangely. It's in human language. You get down on your knees and attempt to listen. You shall die like the other. I tore him apart. It was a pitiful night. The orc's eyes suddenly opened wide and stopped breathing. You have information you came for. The other night is dead. That's so dumb. I'm glad I found him, but fuck you. <laughs> oh, apparently I dropped some shit. Oh, right. The stuff I just put in my wagon. I put on the ground. Ah, it's annoying. But I got it. That's what that's what's important, right? Let's get the rest of his stuff. Might as well. We'll go sell off some stuff. Since we have a ton of it. Ooh, we need a mithril hammer. Oh my god, he's got so much loot. What does one orc need this much shit for? Oh, this is my Sunday gear. This is what I wear when I want to go slaying rabbits. 
or some shit. He has like four Warhammers and like 20 suits of armor. What the fuck is wrong with this guy? <laughs> uh, he's payday, at least for us, huh? I discovered one game mechanic. Putting monsters in a dungeon by spawning them near you, so sometimes sleeping is the answer. But the thing is, when you're on a timed quest, you kind of, you don't want to sleep too much, you know what I mean? So it kind of, it makes you feel like you don't want to do that. Ah, uh, whatever. So be it, we got what we came for. Feels good. Okay, let's go.